a USC student under arrest after he allegedly stabbed a homeless man to death. New details tonight and what sparked a deadly confrontation. Insurance companies refusing to cover high-risk properties as wildfires burn in four Southern California counties. And how you can prepare your home before a brush fire ignites. Mark DeCano is the first openly gay person of color to serve in Congress. During this Pride Month, he has new legislation to expand gay rights. He's here to talk about it. The busy travel season is underway. Know your rights before you fly. Now, this is the Fox News at 6. Welcome, everyone, to the Fox 11 News at 6 o'clock. I'm Marla Tejas. And I'm Ellis Michelson. We begin with breaking news. One of the greatest baseball players of all time has died. The San Francisco Giants just put out this tweet uh, saying that Willie Mays, uh, one of the all-time great home run hitters, uh, has passed away. Yeah, the SF Giants uh, tweet says this. It is with great sadness that we announce that San Francisco Giants legend and Hall of Famer Willie Mays passed away peacefully this afternoon at the age of 93. Forever giant. That's what the logo says there. And isn't that the truth? He is uh, an icon in the world of baseball, not just as a giant, Alex. And you pointed out his ability to hit that ball and to hit it far. Yeah, I mean, he is number two on the all-time home run list uh, to Barry Bonds, although many people think he is the true home run champion uh, because of Bonds' uh, alleged steroid use. Uh, but he also is somebody who was a key in the civil rights movement, overcome so much racism in his day, uh, and was beloved by so many generations of baseball players. You think of Vince Scully calling that home run when he, he bade, uh, bade Ruth for that all-time record. Uh, so there's so many... Great Willie May stories. Our Kyle Kraska is going to be with us soon to talk more about that. But we just finding out about the death of Willie May so just a few moments ago, and we'll have a reaction pouring in throughout the night here on Fox 11. Uh, in the meantime, we want to get to some other local news and a great story of USC, a student there now under arrest and accused of murder after he allegedly stabbed a homeless man to death. But is this murder? Or is it self-defense? Also, it's Matthew Seeler. He's live on USC's Greek Row after speaking with a man, a woman, who says she knows the student we're talking about. Matthew. Yeah, that's right, Alex. A lot of people can't believe this, but police now say that that student claimed the homeless person told him that he had a gun, but this stabbing happened between these two buildings. You might be able to see that surveillance camera. Uh, authorities now looking over the footage. Many people wondering if this was justified. 